Guys, my day has already started so horribly <laughs> and I don't even know where to begin. I need the AC on in my car first. Oh my goodness, okay. I'm sweating. <laughs> I, I literally, I am all over the place. I have never done this before. I'm normally so good with dates and times. And maybe it's because I've been a little sick the last couple of days. I woke up pretty sick on Monday um, and I've just been trying to just rest and I feel so much better today. I think I just had like a little cold. Um, but long story short, I was supposed to go to an Ilya beauty event today uh, and you know, they're gonna have mocktails, little bites, they were gonna have, you know, a makeup artist there, you know, teaching like little classes and stuff. And I think the founder of Ilya Beauty was gonna be there. And I thought it was today. <laughs> and I fully got up, got ready, came to Beverly Hills at 10.30 in the morning. It's 10.30 on the dot right now. I walk in, guys, I walk in. And the girl was like, hi, how can I help you? And I was like, hi, I'm here for the Ilya Beauty event. And it already was kind of weird because it was pretty empty in there. And she's like, oh it was yesterday and i was like oh, <gasps> are you absolutely shitting me i have not done that if i have done it it's been forever because i i do not even remember doing that and i think it was my sick brain i was so out of it the last three days and completely forgot or didn't realize the the day it was on, or I thought today was the 6th, I guess. I don't know, I'm all backwards. I am just at a loss of words. I'm in Beverly Hills now, but it's fine. I was gonna come into this area regardless because I am going to an Oscars party tonight. Woo, I'm actually really excited. And I was going to go to Nana Jacqueline. They have a store here in West Hollywood to uh, borrow a dress to wear for um, the party tonight. So I was gonna come into this area anyway. I thought I was being super, you know, great with time and being like, oh my god, look, I'm going to an event and then I'm gonna be able to go to here and then I'm gonna be able to, eh, 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 and no, no event for me. And what time is it? Oh my god, I told them that, I told them that I'd come in the early afternoon and it is 10 30 in the morning. I was rushing so damn hard this morning. I didn't even have time to make my coffee. I didn't need anything. So maybe I will just treat myself to a beautiful, beautiful brunch, people.
nothing crazy for my face. I do wanna do more of like a grungy look on my eyes, but we'll see. Look at that, look at that sucker right there. Ugh, I just wanna pop it so badly, but I can't, can't do anything. Yeah, I'm planning on doing super natural face makeup, which I don't know if it's the right move or not to do because normally for things like this, you kind of wanna go a little heavier with the face makeup. Oh my goodness. Because you're gonna get photographed and whatever. I feel like as long as I cover my pimples, I'm okay. So I was going back and forth on whether to do my makeup or my hair first because, so for my hair, I'm planning to do a wet look, like a wet hair look. And I have to use baby gel oil. I've never done this before. I've gotten it done in the past, but I've never done it. My hairdresser, Sarah, shout out Sarah, told me that you normally achieve that look by using baby oil gel. I didn't even know baby oil came in gel form. I'm not too nervous about whether it's gonna look good or not because my plan B is I'm gonna just throw my hair up into a pony and then just kind of do like a wet pony look, which is fine. I mean, I don't even know if the wet hair will look good with the outfit I have on. I just really wanna do a wet hair look. I am sweating already and it is cold outside and I have the AC on because anytime I get ready, I start sweating in all of my crevices. It's unbelievable. <laughs> I'm excited for you guys to see the dress I chose. Can you guys guess before I put it on which one I went with? When I was younger, I loved like getting my eyebrows done. I loved getting my nails done. Am I just like insane? But it, everything just feels like a fucking chore. I don't, I don't know why. Like the thought of getting my nails done or going to get my eyebrows done, it's just like, ugh. Like it's just not, it's like pointless. I don't know. Is that me being like, Annoying? I don't know. Yell at me if I'm being annoying. I'm being honest. Yell at me. I, I can take it. I just sometimes I'm like, I don't care to go and make an eyebrow appointment. I don't want to. I can just pluck them myself. Here's my eye makeup. I just did a super smudgy, basic black winged liner. And then I just threw on some sparkly eyeshadow. I don't know. I'm kind of feeling it. I'm gonna do, and then I put some brown lip liner on and then some clear gloss. But I'm gonna attempt to do my hair now. And before you guys scream, absolutely scream at the top of your lungs, my hair is so disgusting. Uh, it needs to be washed. But I was like, why am I gonna wash it if I'm gonna put a ton of baby gel in it? I literally ordered this off Amazon. This is an Amazon Basics baby oil gel. Oh God, okay. Oh, I'm gonna have to do this in sections. There's no way. I just can't imagine someone watching this and knowing that Oh, sweet baby angel, this is gonna come out ugly. And then I'm just, I'm here like, <sighs> like not knowing what I'm doing to myself right now. for this Oscar party like I want a freaking Oscar all right guys I did it all I'm not mad at it I just don't know is it a look is it is it giving a look I like keep it behind my ears maybe okay wait I feel like if I keep it like back it's cute hold on it's like why do I like to be ambitious on nights that I don't have time to be ambitious so I'm holding gel keeps all it all in place. Okay, I do like this. I do love this. Okay, I'm gonna change and then fix up my hair and give you the final look because I got 10 minutes. I got 10 minutes to get to this party. Here is the final look. Okay, I have to go back so far for you guys to see it. Final look, I'm wearing these little heels. Can you see that? Oh my gosh, guys, I'm so late. I'm panicking right now. We're so late. Guys, sorry, I forgot to show you the gloves that it comes with. Okay, now full full outfit look. This is gonna kill me because I'm so late. Little pearly earrings and uh we're off. Okay. There she goes, there she what goes. The hell? I'm already sweating. Come on, pep step us. All right, just testing them out. Okay. Oh, man. Six hours later. Guys! Guys, can you only imagine?
imagine what happened. Um, we didn't get into the party. We didn't even go to the party. We got into our Uber. We got to the venue. We had to wait in a rideshare line to get checked into the venue. And it was absolute chaos. And basically the line for the rideshare was maybe an hour, hour and a half. And our Uber driver was like, I can't do this. And we were like, oh my goodness, obviously. Like there was just no way that our Uber driver was gonna wait that long. And I didn't even want him to wait that long. I felt so bad. So he was an absolute angel and he kind of, we were just all trying to figure it out together. We were waiting in line trying to get get to it we all finally came to a decision where our uber driver was like i'm sorry like i gotta go but if we got out of the car we wouldn't have been able to get into the party so we just decided to come home because we didn't want to get out of the car and then get stuck um yeah so it was just a little chaotic what do i do now i don't know i think caleb is trying to figure out where we can go eat it's like 10 40. we literally got home like 20 minutes ago we were waiting in the car for like for an hour i think trying to get into this party and it just wasn't happening there was so many cars and also what wasn't helping is that there were so many cars trying to cut in front and everyone was trying to shove it was just a nightmare of a situation so anyways i'm back home it's 10 40 and i'm gonna get out of this i don't even know what to do with my hair because my hair is just slicked with a bunch of baby oil gel and got this dress on for for fun i guess look at that but it's okay guys it wasn't meant to be it's fine i just today wasn't my day i think i've come to the realization today's not my day it started off horribly we're good i'm gonna order food have a little glass of wine at home and just get ready to watch the oscars on sunday look at my hair guys it is like greasier than Grease the movie. Oh my gosh. Ooh, okay, okay, Boney. Our wing stop just arrived, and this is what the rest of the night will be looking like for us. Probably we'll have a glass of wine. Oh, sorry, the angle looks horrible. Probably have a glass of wine and go to sleep. How beautiful is that? Mm. It's the next morning and I just need to show you guys what my hair looks like after having 10 pounds of oil in it and washing it three times. It still looks like I have oil in it. So what the hell am I supposed to do about that? I don't know if you guys can even tell. It just feels so greasy still. But what did I expect? What did I expect from that, you know? Do you see that? God, dude. But yeah, I thought I'd just let you guys know my hair is ruined for the day. I don't even know what to do about it. Ew. Mm -hmm.